When working around automotive engines, there's one thing that I do not like to see. Uh, this is way up there on my list, and that's RTV silicone gasket maker. I mean, in my humble opinion, this stuff should be outlawed when it comes to working on gaskets in and around an engine. And you're thinking, well, everybody uses this stuff. It's all over the place. Well, let me show you why I detest this stuff so much. I've seen so many cases where this has been overused on engines that I don't use it at all anymore. Let me show you why. Look at uh, the person who put this gasket on. They smeared it down with RTV silicone sealant. And watch, watch what I found when I removed this uh, vacuum pump from the engine. See this? Look at those pieces. And over here you can actually see pieces falling off. And what happens is these go travel down through the engine. They get in oil passages. I've seen this time and time again, plugging up oiler holes in the camshafts, uh, small oil passage. I've seen you know, this stuff used in uh, water pumps and uh, thermostat gaskets, and it ends up getting down in the climate control valves and gums everything up. So. I tell you, maybe it would be okay if people used just a very small film, but they don't. So I open up an engine. This is what I find down inside in some of the oil passages. So now do you see why I do not like this stuff? And now I'm going to show you what I do like. For sealing paper and cork gaskets, I prefer the products from Permatex. If you want a flexible sealant that does not harden, my very favorite is the Permatex Aviation Forma Gasket you see here. Uh, this stuff's great. You just put on a small film and it doesn't come off and fall into the engine like RTV. And if you need an application where you need a hard setting uh, sealant, then I use the Forma Gasket 1, which is hard setting for also from Permatex. So if you're working on your engine, and you're sealing those type of gaskets, this is what you should be using.